Ciao, I'm Kurshid, a cloud support engineer here at the AWS office in Dublin. Today I'm going to show you how to set up and connect to SMTP using Amazon SES. Let's get started. To send production email through Amazon SES, you can use the simple mail transfer protocol interface or the Amazon SES API. In this section, we're going to set up and connect to SMTP using Amazon SES. In this video, I'm going to show you the steps to set up SMTP with Amazon SES and then connect to the Amazon SES SMTP endpoint to send email. Let's get to the fun part. To begin, we will need to open the Amazon SES console from your AWS console. Once on the account dashboard, you will then need to scroll down to the simple mail transfer protocol settings. There you will find the values for server name and ports. You will use these to connect to SMTP. For example, you will see the following if you are in the EU West 1 region. You will have to note down the server name and port. On the same page, you will have to select create SMTP credentials. By doing so, you will be directed to the IAM console and from there you will see the IAM username and at the bottom of the page the option to create. On this page click download credentials. While on this topic I would like to share that the credentials that you use to send email through the Amazon SES SMTP interface are unique to each AWS region. If you use the Amazon SES SMTP interface to send email in more than one region, you must generate a set of SMTP credentials for each region that you plan to use. Now we need to select the AWS SES SMTP port that you will send the email from based on the connection method you want to use. That is start TLS or TLS wrapper. One important thing I would like to share is that Amazon Elastic Compute Cloud restricts outbound traffic on port 25 for all EC2 instances by default. If you must use SMTP port 25, you can request to remove this restriction or you can select a different port to send email. In the following step, we'll test the connectivity to the Amazon SES SMTP endpoint to test the connection over the port that you want to send email from. For example, you can run the telnet command. Once you confirm that the connection to the port is successful, then you can start using your operating system's command line to start sending email using the Amazon SES SMTP interface. Thanks for watching and happy cloud computing from all of us here at AWS.